Gus and Noah, how you doing? Um, I just wanted to put together a little video. I felt like it could illustrate my point a little better. Um, but I don't think, from what I saw the video, I don't think it's anything to freak out about. Noah, I feel like your swing is looking good. Um, it's just the timing aspect. Timing is the most difficult part of hitting. It's something that you are going to be battling with. As long as you're playing baseball, the timing part is going to be the most difficult thing to find each day. Uh, but I wanted to show you something. Um, and also, I want you to know that when timing is not right, mechanics can break down, bat speed can slow, uh, can slow up. Um, when you're on time and you're synced up, um, then your bat speed will be a little bit faster. Uh, mechanics will look smoother. So timing is so important. So what I want you to see in the bottom photo here, uh, both of these are, are both of these videos are stopped at um, release point of the pitcher. Now Noah, look where you're at. At release point, you are in the same ready position as you were when the pitcher was getting his signs. And if you notice at the bottom, at the release point, uh, the batter at the bottom, he is on his back leg. His foot is in the air already. He's got a little higher leg kick than you. But he's he has his weight back, and he is waiting for the ball in an attacking position, where it looks like to me that you are looking for the ball first and then trying to attack. So as I move forward, as I move forward here, see now the ball's in the air. Now you're starting to move. Now look where the ball is before you even are like right here. You're identifying and seeing the ball. That is way too late. You want to do that closer to the pitcher's mound. So you want to be, so this position right here, you want to do that maybe three frames earlier. You want to do it just as the ball is re releasing out of the pitcher's hand. So again, I don't think it's mechanics. Um, I think everything looks good. Your swing looks stable. Your your base looks good. You look solid in the box. I think it's just when you're beginning, when you're starting your swing. So you want to think as soon as the ball is being released out of the pitcher's hand, that's when you want to start this little, see how you kind of just kind of sit in your legs just a little bit before you move forward? That's what you want. You want to be right here as the ball is released out of the pitcher's hand. So just go back and... Don't get frustrated. Just try to start things a little bit sooner, and I think you'll be in a good place. So hopefully that helps, guys. Have a great day, and uh, be